bonkers. Last, last. Now everybody go to our breakfast. Shayo. Hi Patonkis, hi Bulab, hi Bu Baby, hi family, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you haven't subscribed, please go to get into YouTube, search for my channel, subscribe, hit the like button, share the link, and then show some love. And um, yeah guys, I've been a bit, not really a bit sick, but I've been sick. I've been having this weird trend in flu, which I got from Zen. And also on this video, I'll be doing a bit of a review on my last minute trip to Zim. Ah, okay. So I went to Zim. I'm not gonna say event, but I, I, I actually went to Zim one of the previous weekends. And then it was a last minute trip. I got uh, my flight booked on Saturday. Yeah, it was on a Saturday. My flight was booked for 8 o'clock. 8 p.m. Yes, it was booked for 8 p.m. And then I think no, it was around quarter. It was either quarter past eight or half past somewhere around eight. So on the day of departure, I actually packed around what time was it? I packed around three o'clock during the day, and then by six, I was on my way to the airport. Got to the airport, checked my bag in, and then went to the slow mo. Went to go have something to eat because. And that day I had to go to Alex. I had to go do something in Alex, which I was not able to do, and then I had to come back. And then boom, let's go to Zim Hyperend. And then yeah, got to the slow mo. I got something to eat and also got something to drink. And after that, because I think I had like 45 minutes in the slow mo launch. So after the 45 minutes, my 45 minutes in the slow mo launch, I had to board because it was about time which I did I got in the plane yeah got in the plane that then landed was using the fast jet, the fast jet so I got in the plane and then yeah the plane took off on my way there yeah on my way there I was listening to music and the flight from here I think was about an hour 15 minutes from there come on because when I went there, it was 1 hour 50, 1 hour 50, 40 something minutes. When I came back, it was 1 hour 50 minutes. So I didn't the exaggeration. Okay, but that's fine. I was told that we were going to a friend's party in Zim. Okay. So it's just day like if we are going to a friend's party, what kind of a party is it? So I can know what to expect and what not to expect. Because me and I always have high expectations. Okay, fine. So we went to the party. Same time we got to Zim, it was late. It was no Okay, back to the house. Then I was there, like, let me just change. Which I did. I changed. And then I got on my two piece with sneakers and then with shades on, of course, because there was no deep. And I, was, and I felt so crusty. Okay, fine. We got in the car. The half was just on another level. On another level. So yeah, we got into the car and then we, we go to the club zone. Yeah, club zone. So Mina, as I was going to the party, I had the memo of there's going to be old my cocoa. It's not really old my cocoa. It's going to be those old, old, not really old, but our old station. And then I was just there like, oh, okay. So it means this one is okay, but I think it's <coughs> okay. We go to Trapzo, we get to Trapzo, and when we get there, I'm like, mm -hmm. wow, is this a baby? Okay. <coughs> the Trapzo is not the same as 
vibe you keep that a vibe up okay same as if you guys have been to my hood three step or we get on and enjoy the way which place can I compare to I think maybe by but my cool is much better. Let's just say how overrated coffee matron always is. That's the why. But then ha, the place is overrated. Eh? Okay, we move. So we get to the place and then I'm just being like, oh, what the fuck? I made a good choice by way speaking like because dog. What that is the point of the ghetto, the ghetto, the ghetto. Not that I'm judging it, but yeah, I enjoy the vibe. Not really the vibe, but the alcohol obviously does. So yeah. So fine, we get there, we get inside. When we get inside, we leave. there's a whole lot of people. Damn. And the VIP, there's only one VIP section in the top. Okay. From the door to the VIP is actually full, like it's tight. There is no space for one to pass. Okay, so they made a plan for us to pass, and then we got to the one VIP section, the only VIP section in Pato. Okay, then we get there. <coughs> there's other girls, there's other hands, actually. But the hands, okay. The hands are just not honey, you know. <coughs> Sorry about that. Yeah, so the hands on is just coming, you know. And then I'm just saying, like, mm -hmm. okay. And then, yeah, and then I stood by the window because it was very hot. I was getting hot, but you know, I was So I stood by the window and they were playing. They were playing the day, yeah, so many things. And, and like in them, they mixed everything. Yo. R&B, they mix it and make it sort of a rocker song for us. Good. Not, not only gospel. No, besides the gospel. Your R&B. They kept playing that type of music and it was just... Because I couldn't... It was not music even for me, you know? Because I wanted to... And then, but the vibe was not high. But I was just there, like, you know, like, let me just try to, let me just not be that girl and then try to vibe. Okay. So, <clears throat> I was then asked by the birthday boy, what am I going to drink? And then I was just there, like, um, I'm drinking more in next time. Okay, cool. A few minutes later, three bottles of beverage. I think it was three, yeah, three bottles of beverage. And then two bottles of more in next time came to my table. To the one VIP where I was sitting. Mind me, at your South African clubs or South African group, when they deliver a bottle of AIDS, it comes with that container initial. But yeah, that site, they delivered the uh, beverage in uh, AIDS container. I'll show you. I'll, 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 I'll add a video clip to this. Hey. And then I'm just there, like, already the music is not musical for me. And next thing, a bottle of vape is coming on an ace container. What the fuck? Like, what's going on? What's going on? And I'm just saying, like, what's going on? I'm sorry for the... I'm actually sorry for sorry. Yeah, so I'm just saying, like, what the F? What the F on F is going on? Why is a bottle of vape coming with an ace container? And then I'm just saying, like, if it was back in Black Door, back in, not Black Door, sorry, back in Booth, back in 130, back in Konka, back in Ayapia, there wouldn't be such a thing. And I'm just there, like, you know what, I, let, me, let me just mind my own business, because, man, I'm here to drink. Okay, fine. So, my uh, two bottles came together with the Ace, uh, not Ace. To get out three bottles, of, three bottles of beverage in the other ones and the ace. Mm. Okay, so and then later on they asked whether I wanted a glass. By the look of things on the table, there were no champagne glasses. Not that I'm being judgmental or anything. 
They were drinking from those plastic, your plastic glass bottles. Your takeaway glasses when you leave the group at SA. Shut up. I'm like, no. No. If I drink on a glass, I'm obviously gonna pour until my glass gets full. So, and on top of that, the champagne will, will get hot. Let me just drink from the bottle. Okay, right. So I had my first bottle. Drink it down. And then I ordered Hagi when the shishi came. I asked for gum and mint, they didn't have gum and mint. They had these weird flavors that I don't even know the names. So I had to smoke just because I wanted shisha. Smoke, 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 smoke. And then shisha was done. And then I got on my second bottle. Boom. When my ever was on my second bottle. I saw this other hand and then you know all this sort of not really sort of thing but you know all this outfit that you always see in SA man at the group. So I'm just there like what is this outfit doing in film? Only to find out okay to the girl baby girl is from, is from SA as well. Okay cool. So we later on exchanged numbers, started vibing vibing together, they were playing their music, playing like not really imagine Afrobeat for like Five seconds and then back to them. Five seconds back to them. As soon as we were happy, the routine was back to them. Okay, fine. So baby girl had to leave. The other, the uh, the baby girl from the other baby girl from SA had to leave. The baby girl actually from SA that I met had to leave to go to another shop. And then Mina, I was sleeping and when I was going down. And then yeah. They started singing for the birthday boy. Oh, what happens? What happened at the club was when a bowler gets to the club, they make a shout out to the bowler, and then the bowler has to say what is he bowling on tonight. After that, the bowler has to like tip the MC, and after tipping the MC. They either have to play one song for him, he repeat like a song they played for him, blah blah blah, that's up the nonsense. But I was just saying like, by the babies, let's just enjoy. We enjoyed our night and then from the we drove to the gents' uh, family house, his mom's house, yeah. So we get there, Mina I had passed up in the car. No, before that, we went to some other event, sort of an event at the stadium or something like some set up and it like that. So we got there. As we get to that event, there's just too many people. And people think, good to me now, I know how to speak Shona. And I'm just there, like, I'm Mina, yes. Okay, fine, bye, the babies. So we get to the event. We got there, like, we didn't actually stay you know, we didn't stay long we i think we spent like less than five minutes we were out of here and then after we left that event that's when i passed out yeah passed out woke up when we got to the gents uh family house when we got there he was showing me his houses fine skip and the next thing i see people eating i'm like what is people what are these people eating it was done of the night I mean, oh, it was 80 hours. I think it was around 4 or 5 in the morning. I'm just there, like, well, what are the people saying? And then the gen came with a roast pub, chicken, cheese, and then coleslaw. It was my first time enjoying the pub. I think maybe it was because I was drunk. I had to eat. So I don't wake up any. We had pop and chicken together with the customer and then from there we went to the house to go to sleep. And yeah, and then we woke up the next day, same day later on, around 10 on 9, between 9 and 10, woke up around somewhere on that time. And then we had to drive to the other house at the Bundu 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 in was a place in Mor Morewa or Mora something. I told you that name the place properly because me not you know that. So yeah, we drove to the bottle store first. We get to the bottle store. He's like, "Tell me, do you want to drink?" Like it's in the morning. I didn't even eat. Do you want to drink? I didn't even brush my teeth because there was no water in the house. So we had to go to the other house. Just 
say that to him. I need to be like, what do you mean give me? I want a drink. I just hi, I have money. I need to eat first so I can start drinking. Okay. So I was like, I should choose whatever I want to drink. Got me three bottles more, three bottles more in the and then they got them drive whatever, and then yeah, we drove to to the other house in Morre. I think it's Morrewa. Yeah, Morrewa. If I'm not wrong, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, but we drove to Morrewa. We got to Morrewa. When we got the, I went to go take a bath. I went to go run a bath because I was really, really, really sweating. Oh, before that, we first went to the hotel. We had to go order something to eat, and then yeah, from the hotel we went to the house. Go to the house. I took a bath, and then after taking a bath, I think yeah, not I think I took a nap, a power nap, power nap. Took a power nap when I woke up. Oh, we picked up other girls, other gays. So the gays were just there because. Me not even speak sure now. You can't come to me speaking your home language. So the game was just there. We were not conversating. They felt like I was antisocial because I was always here. Yeah, not saying anything to them. The only person I was speaking to is my gen. Let me let me give him a name. The only person I was speaking to is Sebastian. So fine, fine, thanks. And then when I woke up, Sebastian was asking, Do I wanna drink? I'm like, yeah. And then he took one bottle to go put in the deep freezer so it's so it could, you know, get cold. So, I think in like 30 minutes he came up with the bottle. That's when I started drinking. And the other girl came to me and then she was like, she started off by speaking Shona and I was just saying like, what the F on F because they told you I don't speak your language. And then she was like, how you doing? I'm like, I'm okay, how are you? I'm okay, shop, shop, shop. Why are you so grumpy? And like, I just woke up and I have a headache. I'm like, yes. Okay. And then she was like, you seem to be so antisocial. And then Sebastian overheard the conversation and he was like to me, don't let this girl propel you, you know. <laughs> She's too forward. She's, the girl seemed to be forward because, yeah, she was. And I figured the reason why she is, she's still young, she's still growing. Ugh, by a baby. And then yeah. So after that, I started drinking. We were all chilling outside. As we're chilling outside, Nina and Puzai, Noe Nekta, the gillies were drinking. I don't know what the gillies were drinking because when I woke up, they were halfway drunk, they were tipsy, and they were dancing. Like everything was so weird. Then I was just there, like, let me just mind my own business as usual. So, I minute mean, I was minding my business, I was just on my phone, connected to the Wi Fi, trying to communicate with my hands, with my dollies. But the network is not networking, okay, fine. And then, oh, Sebastian was like, I should connect and play my music because was being playing the music. So, we should just change, like, give each other turns. Now it was my turn to connect. When I was connecting, all the dollies were acting up saying, Why am I not playing the music? And I'm just there, like, in my mind, I'm just there, like, You guys have been playing the music for over three hours. I went to go sleep. You guys are still playing your music. I came back. You guys still are playing music. Now it's my turn to shine. Okay, the moment was mine. I was playing music. Obviously, I was playing off a bit. And that's when. Utrella started connecting. Okay, cool. So that day the girl is oh later on the older sister came to me after she was drunk because I was playing pool with the jets. So she only saw an opportunity to talk to me right then because she was drunk. Okay fine and then I just say that oh hi girl, how are you? She's like she's okay, cool. Can you teach me how to play pool? I'm like, oh okay, cool. And she's like, in return, I'll teach you to speak my language. So I'm like, okay, cool. So, as I was busy trying to teach a baby girl, I'm not really perfect girl pool because I'm still learning. So as I was still trying to teach a baby girl how to play pool, the younger sister, the Tashara won the forward one, let me just say it, put it like that. The forward one, let's call her Madibu Singh. Madibu Singh came 
and she was like to me why am i not dancing oh when i started playing through this when they switched back to the music she was like why am i not dancing why am i not dancing what do you mean do i not dance have you seen me dancing before am i your mate do you know me before joking i was just there like to go i don't know how to dance i'm gonna make a plan once i'm drunk when i'm here that's when i can make a plan and then the baby girl was like, no, drink, 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 so you can get drunk, so you can start dancing with us. I'm like, baby girl, even if I get drunk, I won't. I'm the, I only make a plan when I'm out there, when I'm at the groove, not when I'm locally grooving, like in the house. <coughs> okay, fine. So after that, ooh, doll. Eh, uh, the older one who's... The older one is Mas Chab. So Mas Chab was like to me, oh yeah, they, oh, Sebastian did ask if I wanted to, like, if I wanted to drink to eat from the hotel. And from the hotel, they had like papa with uh, either fish and then they have bridge. Those three dishes that are more of the same as spinach, but not spinach. Because I'm, I, thought it, I, thought they was, I thought it was spinach actually. So they had those burgers and then they also had chicken and they also had steak but it was a nice but it was a bit hot. Bit hot, it should not talk. It was hot. Sorry, hot, not hot. So I said they could buy the chicken and fish because the fish was nice when I had to eat the If I saw the food kind of and then there was no hot for them, it was rice and steak. And then I was happy because it was right. So, Master Chava is like, to me, doll, let's get a bigger plate so we can eat together. I'm like, oh, you wanna, you wanna share the same plate with me? Okay, doll, no problem. So, Master Chava got a bigger plate. She pushed for me and her, and then from the we went to go eat. So, we get there, and now Master Chava is being weird because I said the fish, not really weird, but she's being otherwise. To me, she wasn't, like, she was a bit off. Because of the tea, during the day, I enjoyed the fish. Now she wanted me to have the whole, the whole fish, like a whole baby, not really baby fish. But it was, it was big. Hey. Now she wants to feed me. Are you mad? Why are you feeding me? Why all of a sudden you want to feed me? Hey, I'm like, okay, let me just eat. When I ate, she fed me even those greeny things which I thought was peanuts because I was enjoying them. She was feeding me those greenies. I don't know what they call them. I was eating it. And then I got food and then I went to wash my hair. And then I came back with another bottle. The first bottle was out. And I came back with the second bottle. And then I continued drinking. And then more people came. More people came and then yeah. So something said to me, go to the room. I went to the room. What was I looking? Oh, I wanted to go pee. Went to the room. When I get to the room, Master and Mandy Pussing are in my room. What are they doing in my room? That's the first question. What are they doing? Because like they were busy with something and when I got there, hey, when I got there, it was just another story. I was here, ha, ho, charango, uti, I keep, I keep. And then, when I'm just there, like, in my mind, I'm just there, like, what are they doing here? What are they doing now? Because there's other rooms which they've been using during the day, and there's other bathrooms besides. Okay, shop. So, when I just go to the bathroom, I pee. And then, I went back. They got back in the room again. After like, after a young 30 minutes again, I came back. When I got back again, they were there. Like, have you seen somebody busy with something? When you get there, they act as if they're not doing whatever they were doing. Something like that. When I get there, my handbag is open. Okay. So Bashan suitcase is also open. It is on top of the bag. It's like someone was busy on the back. Someone was busy with the back or on the back. Whatever. I had a baby. Someone was busy searching for something on Sebastian's suitcase. So Sebastian. So Mina and this day, like when I left here, both bags were closed. What's going on? 
and then they lied to me. Do you know what toilet paper is? We should be looking for the toilet paper. And somebody's back, are you mad? Okay, bye. So, and then I said to them, I don't know where the toilet paper is, honestly. Then I used, I, I did, uh, I made use of the bathroom and then I applied bottom in my lips. I went back, back to where the party was. And then for the third time, that's when I said I was going to sleep. So, I told them to see Dolly's, I'm going to sleep, I'm tired. Like, I'm tired. Like, I really was tired. And it was around 10 o'clock, I think, somewhere around 10, half past 10, yo, 10, half past 10, yeah, somewhere around that time. I went to go see. When I get to the room, again, these babies are still here. Yeah. Okay. So now they're like, Am I am I sleeping? I'm like yes. I'm tired. I'm sleeping. I need to wake up tomorrow. I'm going back. Okay. So the dollies were like, my meal was on a Sunday. Next day was Monday. I was supposed. I'm supposed to come back on Monday. So the dollies are like, she didn't, okay. The other one removes the suitcase. She throws the suitcase and she removes it from the from the bag. Actually. Okay. I get to. Okay, I waited for them to leave so I could undress and then put on a t shirt and then dozed off. And then, somewhere around like midnight, they were still, they were still drinking. I was just thinking, like, can I just continue with my sleep? I, I, I owe myself this one. Continue it with my BTC and then, fine. Around your half past one, between one to three, somewhere around there, there's a Sebastian came to sleep. Sebastian came to Sebastian came to sleep. A few seconds after he got on board, somebody opened the door, got inside the room. Okay, maybe I'll just stay like maybe it's one of his guys coming to get some of my room. I'll just stay like bitch, go back to sleep, relax. I went back to sleep. And then, as I was sleeping, I could I could hear things moving from the room. At some point, I thought I was I was crazy. Okay, I'm like, let me just give it a two minutes to maybe things will get back to normal. Maybe things will stop moving around. Try to close my eyes. I could still feel things moving from the room and then I woke up, sat on my ass. When I was browsing around the room, I found Master Chaba sitting on the carpet doing what in the dark, I don't know. Like it was so weird, I even got scared. And I wanted to wake Ooh, Sebastian up and then I was just there, like, he's peaceful, he's even snoring, where do I start? And I'm just being like, bro. Yeah. When I woke up, she was busy with something. But then when I woke up, she stopped doing whatever with an immediate effect. And she, like, she, she said that she said that she said they still as if she wasn't doing anything. Like I was a fool. I was a fool in all of this. Okay, fine. And I'm. In my mind, I'm like, what's really going on? Is she stealing money from Sebastian's parents or what? Like, what is baby girl up to? As soon as I, not as soon, like, as I was busy asking myself questions, a baby girl stood up and then opened the room and then she left. Okay. When she, yo, okay. Like, I couldn't sleep. I was so scared. Trying to figure out what's really going on. What is she up to? Why is she why is she in our room and why has she been in our room? Why was my bag open? Then I would just say like, you know what? You're not in your country, you don't know how how thing how things are done in them. Just just not really kneel down, but pray. Could it be like of words? Yeah. yeah. Like I was so so scared. At the same time, I didn't know what to do, and then I just closed my eyes. I started praying. That's the only thing that made. That's the only thing 
that made me to go back to sleep. That's how I was able to go back to sleep after pay. I started paying and then after pay, I went back to sleep. I woke up in the morning. When I woke up, everything was just normal in the house. The girls, the dollies were not talking, not dollies, the girlies were not talking to me. They only said good morning. And after they were giving me this awkward vibe, I don't know whether Mas Chaba told Madi Busehore I saw her or what, but eh, something was just off in the house. Okay, fine. Then we woke up and oh, Sebastian said good morning to me. I said good morning back. He was like, do I have breakfast? I said yes, but I, ha- I want to have break breakfast, not your papa. Because I know other people have bad for breakfast, sorry to say that. And then he was like, okay, cool, let's go buy Ama soft drink and then other things to make breakfast. Ama ingredients to make breakfast. We went to the store and then we bought a few things and we came back. As, as we have a store, I wanted to buy <laughs> your simple chips, but those ones, they were not make sure. And then I decided to, you know what, let me rather not. And then we also, uh, yeah, I had to drive back to the house. Go to the house and then I made breakfast. If I, I made breakfast for everyone. And after that, I went to go take a nap. It's a question. When we woke up, I took a bath. And then after that, I had to start getting ready. Sorry, we got I got really packed my things. I was still wondering whether to tell Sebastian or to tell one of his boys. I don't trust this. Like from the get go, I never trusted those girls. So, to the guys, I didn't know how to break it to the teeth. You know, it just happened and it happened because when I'm not used to such. Yeah, so. That's okay, fine. When I got back, uh, now we drove from the village, from that village to the other village, from Morera to the other house in the other village, or in Harare. I think. Much wrong. Drove today, and then when we got there, I had to grab my sneakers and my other hat bag, put them in a suitcase, and then go to the airport. Go to the airport, and then I. Eh, things were very weird when I had to go to the store mall because I don't know which which was which. So I went there. I just went to a music market inside the airport to go buy water. And then buy a chocolate bar, and then I went to go sit by those waiting chairs next to your wedding gift because I didn't want to start. I didn't want to start a conversation with anyone because people are just speaking their whole languages, and me now I don't speak Shona, and I'm not feeling so like that because you know why? Never that. Yeah, so I got on the and then I came back to SA. Came back to SA, and then that was it. And then that'll be another story. I'll see you guys in the next I sip this girl video. Please show some love. Bye, Tony.